YouTube Minecraft, what is up? Welcome to a new video and a new series. I'm going to be showing you guys how I beat Minecraft, basically. So right now, I'm in my realm, and there's really not much built in this one. This is a brand new realm, brand new world. I did have a whole bunch of stuff saved up to show you guys, but unfortunately, the videos got corrupted, so all the progress of what I already did is no longer available. So, what I'm doing right now is just moving my stuff from point A to point B. I'm going to put the finishing touches on the roof. I gotta get more wood. And I gotta get this stuff going so that way I can start getting some farms. I have a food farm. I need to make an automated sugarcane farm. We're about to go into the nether. I didn't record me going to go get the obsidian because it literally took me like an hour to find it. So we got the obsidian. I got myself a... Uh, a village somewhat nearby that has a librarian in it, so I stole the books from him, made myself an enchantment table, found some diamonds, and we're running low on resources. So, let's get this built out here just for now. This is going to become our infinite wood source, so as much as this gets out, the better. That way... When it comes time to actually build my sugarcane farm, I'm actually going to make it bigger than it was in the last uh, world. So, for right now, I need to move you over to the area. Right now, I'm just getting everything organized. The next thing I need to make is a smoker so we can start smoking food. I apparently did not... That actually puts a damper in that plan, but no fear. I got some right here, and we're going to make another cauldron. Okay, dokily. And now uh, I need to get more dripstone, but for right now, we're just going to use cobblestone to build this. And you can go right there. Okay, so we need to go up. One, two, three, four. That should be high enough. needs to go there, this one needs to go right here, that needs to go right there, I did not bring a pickaxe, I got this one on me, let's use it up, there's a cauldron right here, so we need to put one, two there, and then one here, and then one there, that should be all of them, so that means, I used to come down here, oh, I need to come down here anyways, but we need to break the doubles apart, Nope, not that one. This one, this one, this one, and these two. And I don't have my ladders on me. We're going to quickly run back inside, get the ladders, get our infinite fuel source going. That's that. That's kind of like basically what I do now in any world. I go right for an infinite fuel source because coal is very scarce. This feels like, to me anyways... For other people, it might not feel that way, but for me, I feel like coal is few and far between for me. Alright. Now we can get rid of... Well, I'm actually going to keep that just like that. And that will drip in over time. Alright. Our next step. Finishing the house. I'm going to smelt some stuff so I'll see you guys in a second. Alright. So the house is pretty much one point that done at this point. There's just a couple more things I need to do. Let's just finish this up. And then the lighting, of course, needs to get done. And right now we're using those good old torches. But we are slowly but surely getting this little house done. This is going to be the start of a base. And then I'm going to make some other stuff later on down the line. But for right now, i got to get this done. And then we're going to head into the nether.
and I'm going to make the nether portal. I want to make it this high, because if I make it this high, it might send me somewhere weird. Which chest is my obsidian in this one? There it is, okay. We're going to do it. Right over... Right down here, I think, I actually want to put it. I just want to put down an outline real quick, but I don't have any blocks. Actually, I do. So, one, two. It needs to go. Put it down two blocks. Or a block, I should say. That should be plenty. If I get rid of this, have everything built in right here. And I think I'm one shy. Which is fine, I can go get another piece, but we have flint and steel. Let's get our nether portal made up and going as we're just sitting here waiting for this to finish cooking. Get this going and we'll be good to go. That may or may not be enough. Let's hit it real quick. Test, take a check, and a C. Nope, still not enough. But it is enough to get that almost all the way done. All right. Hammer, lama, dama, ding dong. Let's get into the nether. Where'd we spawn? Damn, why is it every world I spawn in is a bastion? Uh, not a bastion, a soul sand. Oh, big, big, bingo, bingo, spongo. But this is a not a bueno location. This is a location of death <laughs> and despair. But we got access to the nether, so we can get the nether quartz that I need while I'm here. I believe it's one nether quartz. Her! How would I hit the lava? Okay. Now I believe it's one nether quartz per observer. And I need redstone, and I don't think I have a lot of it yet, but I will be able to go mine some of it. That will be in the next video, so... Getting the observers made to make this automated bamboo farm. Because so I also need a lot of iron. So I can make... Railroads. Okay, we got... 15, that should give me plenty. Let's get out of here. We have infinite lava now at this point in time, so I can make the infinite lava farm even bigger. Thinking I'm gonna swap these two rooms because I'm coming in on that side and my bed's right there, and I'd rather be able to come in and start cooking and making stuff that way. So let's let's do that as well. Let's let this stuff finish melting. All right. Now I need a diamond pickaxe, so I gotta find my diamond pick. I need to move this stuff out of here. I'm actually going to put the furnace on this wall. And then in this room, I want it to be centered to 
We're also going to put the brewing in here as well. So this needs to finish first, but for right now I'm thinking we're going to put it up against that in this section. Right there, that would be ideal because then I can do this. And then these are good to go. This is good to go. So we'll just take this out. What do we put a lava bucket? I know, but right now I want to just get stuff situated. So I'm actually gonna dump everything on me. That's food-wise. Well, I can't really dump everything. Uh. Stone cutter can go outside. We don't need you right now. I don't think I took the stone out. <laughs> so we're gonna go grab this. And if I don't have enough space to pick it all up, it's not that big of a deal. And we did. Another chest here, and then we can put a furnace and a smoker next to each other. Food items in the chest. That can go in the chest for now. Brewing station, we're going to put... Crafting table can stay here. This is going to be our brewing section. This stuff needs to get ripped out. And whatever doesn't get picked up, it's no big deal right now, so... This is tools for right now. At this moment, this is tools and valuables. Books can go in there. All right. This needs to finish smelting before I rip it out. So that's staying here. This is building blocks. You're all going to go over to the storage room there. I'm actually going to make a keep this double chest in here. I'm going to go right there. That is going to be our brewing stuff. I'm going to move the crafting table over there, and then over here, we can just do this. Where'd that piece go? I don't even know where that came from. Don't need any of this stuff right now. I'm going to make it... Oh, I don't think I have any redstone whatsoever. has nothing. I have no redstone, so I can't even make that. Okay. Poop. Uh, Alright, the rest of this stuff can just go in here for right now. Alright. All this can just go into here. Hang on to the sticks. The door can go in there. The crafting table is going to stay in my inventory. And then stone cutter get Stay out of my house. We just need, we're just going to turn the rest of this into this. Alright, with that, the house is now complete. So this is going to be storage room, bedrooms. I want to move my bed over from this corner door, corner to this spot. Right about here. Respawn point set. You can only sleep at night. Now, t the design work itself, I don't need to worry about. The lighting is another story. I need to get some lighting uh, over here and here. And up corner, just have it. this corner. Let's put them up there for right now. Okay, so the lighting should be good in the house, so no mobs will spawn in. It was a pretty productive video, I'd say. I gave you guys... Th this is a build from someone else in my realm, by the way. But... Now the lava is flowing correctly, which is good. In the next video, I will be starting the... I will be getting books. And this has got to get fixed.
Because if I were to do... Hold on now. I'm thinking. The enchantment, if I were to put the enchantment table right here... No, it would have to literally go like right here. But the doors would be in the way, so that's not going to work. So... These glass panes... I put them in not thinking. It's going to be only part of the house that is not symmetrical and that does not bother me that much. It kind of does, but I had just enough, right? So in the next video, I'll be getting books and I will be getting the redstone I need to finish up my build. But if you guys like this video, please leave a like on it. Subscribe. If you're not subscribed because it's free and you should subscribe because my content is magnificent and fantastic. But anyways, in the, the next video, I'll, I'll be making an automated sugarcane farm. Show you guys how to do that. I know I have a video on the channel, but I'll show you guys how to do it. I'll be getting a whole bunch of iron tonight off the video because it just takes a long time to get stuff. And I'm sure none of you want to watch 10 hours of mining. <laughs> but if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out. Enjoy it. Enjoy!